welcome back today we are going to be going shopping i've been seeing a lot of people filming about what they spend how they shop the increase in prices and all these things that is happening and i've just decided to film a video of how much i spend today for our shopping so the way we shop is we do two like we shop almost every weekend let's just be sincere mostly during the week we do not shop because we, who has time but we shop almost every weekend two weekends is heavy shopping similar to what you're going to be seeing today and the other weekend is just we need two slices of bread oh doritos finished pringles finished very very light it's like maybe sometimes less than 50 dollars shopping that's what i refer to the other weekends but this particular one is the typical one where we go all out i usually go to costco in the past but i've stopped going to costco in recent times because i've just realized that some of the things we buy at costco because we buy them in bulk and in big sizes they end up wasting so we've scrapped out costco and we're just buying from Coles, woolies and any shop we see around usually i maintain a list on google keep i don't know i can put the screenshot of the app on my phone it's just like my normal shopping list i had i subtract and because it allows me to check and like tick boxes so i really like that um app for keeping my shopping list but let's not lie anytime i get into the store i just allow the spirits tell me what we need <laughs> I go back to it for reference, especially when there are things I actually would need that I might forget. I usually, at the end of my shopping, I'm just like, okay, have I gone through everything we have on the list? And most times, there's always something in addition I've seen in the store that I just pick up. So, today, you guys are going to be going through. I'm not going to take you to the shop. I've just said that anything I want to do, like take you guys to the store, I need to go to the store early. But it did not work out that way today. So... When I come back, I'm going to do a haul of everything I got and you guys will see how much it cost me. Morning has broken, my windows are open. Wanna feel the wind blow through my hair. Which way do I follow? What happens tomorrow? I turn to you. So I'm back guys and this is everything I got. I spent a total of $540 in total today. And um, boy, oh boy, I'm sure these humans in this house will consume everything in the next one or two weeks. But let's get right into it. I'm going to go through everything. The first item I have here is the Bundaberg um, drink. So one is passion fruit and one is ginger beer. I got two of this for $16, both I got from Aldi. This item I have here is the Kids Popper. They are orange juice or apple juice that they take to school. I got this for $15.60. So I usually just get two orange every fortnight. I get two or two packs of orange which comes in six pieces and two packs of apple juice that also comes in six pieces so per fortnight they just have 12 pieces and basically they take this to school the other thing i got is this apple juice so this is what they take at home before now i actually let me show you guys to save cost at some point i actually got this and used to fill it up with this one but my husband said like it's such it's so much trouble filling it up and washing this during the week especially because of how busy we are so we just went back to buying this but we still have this one anyway if we are going out you know once in a while we can actually use this one so because this is actually cheaper we usually buy this two liter for two dollars sixty nine cents so compare it to this one that a pack is three dollars i think three dollars fifty thereabouts so if you're comparing it this is way cheaper and this will last them a week and more but you know convenience sometimes you have to pay for it i also got a pack of bottled water i've not bought this in a long time i usually buy from costco this was nine dollars eighty cents and then this you got that tofu me always takes um for breakfast tofu me loves this so much one is one dollar twenty nine cents each for the six is seven dollars seventy four cents i also got sanitizer i usually buy this laundry sanitizer from audi i bought this two for eight dollar fifty eight cents so which is cheaper compared to if you're buying from Coles or any of these other stores next item is this bread sliders usually we buy the other sliced bread bread but they didn't have it so this will do for this week it's kind of will last for the week because usually we'll buy six pieces of the bread bread but they didn't have it so i just picked up two of these this don't me and fairy finish one of this per day i'm even surprised they've not eaten it maybe because they've not seen it since i came back or because they've just been eating other stuff i bought but this is $6.99. I even, whenever they eat, I'm always shouting. This one is $6.99. That's $7 each. I bought two. So let's just say the two is for $14. 
I got this uh, another bundle bag. So I got the can one and I also got the bottle one. Most especially in case we are hosting or anybody comes visiting and Obi takes it to work as well. Again, I got one ginger bear and then one tropical fruit. It was on sale at Kohl's. I think I got the two for $11, which was a good deal. Compared to, no, I think at Willis it was at, on sale. I actually, that's one thing you should always do. Whenever you are shopping in any of these stores, make sure you are comparing prices. When I saw this at Kohl's, it was $7.40. 45 cents but when i saw it at woolies they were on 40 percent off and i got it two for 11 cents compared to almost 16 dollars i would have got it from holes and then this one as well it's at calls it was seven dollars 45 cents each and then when i got to howdy it was on sale for 5.99 or there maybe 5.95 something and i got the two for 11 dollars so always compare was it 11 or 12 dollars i think 5.99 at howdy so i got the two for $12. I also picked up a pack of Sprites. This was $6.75. It was on sale. For me, whenever I see things on sale, I just want to grab it because some of these opportunities, once lost, you are going to find your heart to get it again. I picked up flour, one plain flour, one self raising flour. For puff puff, for any quick snack we need to make, and I got them $1.29 $1 each from out. I also made a quick stop at the fruit market i picked up this lemon for one dollar 99 cents which i don't think is bad obi takes on lemon and water all the time but for me i use it for cleaning and that's why i picked it up I actually need to clean my microwave so picked up this baguette Selena introduced me to it a while ago i bought it before it's in the it is in my pantry but i've not cooked it because one cannot be enough so i just saw it on sale today again and then i picked up one more so now i think i can cook it but it is expensive this is three dollars whereas if i buy the normal howdy um spaghetti i think is 89 cents and that one will fill all of us compared to this one that will not that won't be enough for a whole family that is still three dollars i don't think i'll be buying it except there's something special about it when i cook it but then again it is not budget friendly um nah 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 i'll just rather buy my healthy one 89 cents. some capsicum i actually have capsicum in the freezer but they were they had some like all this very soft one outside so i just picked up a few pieces of this it was one dollar per pack because it is they think it's soft i don't know why they, anyway whatever is the problem it doesn't it's not a problem for me i'm going to blend everything and cook tomorrow i don't have time it's cheap 89 cents i said 89 99 it's just like one dollar each so i just picked up a few pieces that was available i was actually after the green one because i want to make ayamashi maybe during easter or during the holiday so this is what i was after and then i saw that and picked it up as well i was lucky that last week or the week before when i went to the fruit market they were running sales on capsicum and would you believe that i bought a box of capsicum for 14 dollars the cheapest i bought the box of capsicum in the last four years was 34 dollars but i don't even know what type of sale they were running but unfortunately i was not even able to communicate to people to go and buy it before it sold out but anyways i i was so sad i could not even do that but anyway it's what it is i picked up tomato this tomato i don't know what was in my brain when i picked it up i don't know i don't need up to four i just need few pieces and then i realized i bought it expensive 19 dollars for four bags of tomato i don't know what was in my head i didn't do my my math was done math thing i picked this one by mistake i picked up four bags of tomato just to put in the fridge for 20 dollars when I can buy a box conveniently for even cheaper, but anyways, it's what it is. What this sweet chili is not right. I'll put it in the fridge, but I'll use it at a later date. It will get ripe in a bit. Again, I got this for three ninety nine. I picked up okra as well. This okra, I just want to put it clean. I have stew or soup that you can use for plain okra in the fridge. So yeah, I just want to cook this one plain. We've been doing a last for a while, but this I got for six dollars. This is okra. I picked up this um, box of digestives, like digestive, I don't know, this is the first time I'm actually seeing it, you guys might have seen it before, a box of digestive, and then it comes in mini packs, I really like it, because I can take it to work, Kobe can take it in his lunch box as well, it's really like cute, the, I really like digestives, like growing up, but the reason why I've not been buying it or eating it in recent times is, like it gets soft easily it is not actually a hard biscuit but once you open it up it gets soft and then everything is just away so i don't buy it but now that it comes in smaller parts for sure i'm going to be buying it i really like it there's another one that comes with milk chocolate hopefully they also make that one in mini sizes like this and it comes with 12 packets inside and i picked this up for just five dollars and then i got custard i see a lot of people drink this custard i don't know how they drink it 
or maybe it's just meant to be like i don't know i don't know anyway i want to see what it tastes like i want to see if it's like nigerian custard or what we can drink what do they use if how to make it pre it's the oven no that's how to make apricot anyway i'm going to taste this and see what it looks like imagine for something i just want to try i don't know how it tastes this is i spent five dollars thirty cents saw supplements on sale i know people have been advertising like you need supplements did I say advertising? I've been emphasizing how much we need supplement as we grow older. I'm approaching mid thirties and definitely I'm one of those people that need it. So I just saw this on sale. The sale is the attraction again. This was eleven dollars. So it is. I'm coming. Let me see this to focus. So it's central for women, support energy, immunity, bone health, and healthy skin. So I feel like that is a good one for eleven dollars. Not too bad. So I got that. I picked up this condensed milk for three dollars. Attraction again. It was on sale. When we went into, was it Coles or Woolies? One of those stores. Anyways, we saw this on sale and Kofumi was saying and anyways Fred has always been saying that oh mommy why don't we eat cheese why don't we eat cheese maybe she has forgotten but sometimes last year I actually cooked cheese with spaghetti or something I don't even know what anyway I bought cheese and we did not like it everybody in this house we tried it it wasn't nice but you know um so this tofu me said oh that his friends used to bring this to school so this is basically um jats biscuits which i know they eat very well has some sausages in it which of course they eat and then has some cheese so we want to try from here and see if it's something they will like and if they do we'll definitely buy more of it and how much did i buy this one this was four dollars 95 cents it is expensive if you ask me but mostly if they like it obviously they sell um cheese blocks so i would rather buy that and slice it into tiny pieces myself compared to just buying it because i also bought this biscuit pack i think two big pack was four dollars so why would i be buying this this is just convenience they are selling to people i cannot buy this this is five dollars for what but anyways for us to try i don't think it's bad i got a bag of carrots dollar 70 cents from Coles. i got two jars of ketchup funny enough it's only tofu me that eats ketchup in this house but the way the boy consume it is very fast i initially got one from Coles for six dollars sixty cents and then when i got into woolies i saw that it was on sale for five dollars fifty so i just picked that in total everything came to about twelve dollars and one cent there about tofumi also picked up that's the problem of taking kids to the store tofumi went with me for shopping today and he picked up this che che cheetos flamey hot puffs for two dollars seventy cents anyway i almost finished it to be honest but to finish after today i may not come back to it for anything he wanted to try it because it says hot that he might like it and he, he liked it i think he ate it i don't know how much of likeness he has for it i didn't finish it and this is fury's um favorite breakfast um yogurt and tofumi also takes it to be honest and again why i've shopped this much again is school holidays is here they are going to be home for two weeks and i'm going to be working the most of it so i just want the house stocked with food so that they can help themselves to eat while i'm busy working so and they are going to be eating a lot during school holidays like if you know you know anyway i got three packs of this because they finished this in no time and i think one is about how much is it um five dollars one is five dollars most times i get it on sale but today it was not on sale so i paid fifteen dollars for the pack of three that i got if you know you know i love me my sachet coffee so i usually just buy it when it's on sale with this one again they always sell it for seven dollars there about but i always buy when it's on sale if i buy full price just know that i'm desperate but i don't ever get to that point where i'm desperate hardly would i be at that point so i picked up two pieces three dollars eighty cents by next week if you go there you'll see them that they're selling it for seven dollars again but i just track when it's on sale and just pick up so i picked up two of them i've been struggling with migraine for a while now and i think i've mentioned it on this channel a couple of times but anyways i actually have a medication i am on i think max max malt or whatever that thing is called but i forgot my prescription at home today and i'm running low so what i just did is pick up this ibuprofen as backup god forbid i have any episode during the week i can use this to see myself through to when i go and refill my prescribed medication and it is not over the counter unfortunately so I, anyway the long story is i picked up this ibuprofen for seven dollars just to help me 
can see me through the week. Sense Booster. I picked up three pieces of Sense Booster because it was on half price. I can never buy this Sense Booster full price. There's no need. I don't need that. I don't need it that much. I'm not that desperate to have it. But it was on half price. So I got each one for $15.50. And the three I got for $46.50. Um, for six dollars fifty cents, which is not bad, but she is for puff puff. I picked up flowers, so as you know, I picked up yeast. Going to making some puff puff, and I got this for four dollars eighty cents. Most of my laundry items, if it is not on sale, I don't buy them full price. I saw color kachada that it was forty percent off there about. Anyway, I picked up these three for twelve dollars, and this will last a long time. Obi takes the sugar, thick and creamy. I bought this for three dollars, and yeah, to the kids like they just love it in mini size. It's the same thing the same products imagine this is five dollars and this is three dollars i don't know if you give them this one they will almost not want to take it i don't know it's just a mindset thing like this. i also picked up this butter fully i just buy it and always have extra in the fridge because sometimes it's just finished i don't know i don't buy margarine i don't buy any other thing this is what i use for bread for cooking for baking for everything i use it and i got it for five dollars from audi why tofu me likes apple juice first of me likes orange juice so i buy I have the pure orange juice so i got this for four dollars 69 cents i don't know why tofumi does not like the undiluted orange juice it likes the artificial one it, i bought the pure one um, the undiluted 100 percent apple juice for him in the past and he said he didn't like it but free likes the on why why don't you like it but there's this you see that apple mango and orange one yeah in the food I like it. you like that one mm -hmm. oh okay yeah i can continue buying that one for you then anyway this one is pure orange juice and fury and Adadi. i think two of them are the one who takes that the most i don't really take all of these things i just walk and feed all of them and then i got this for free so i mean she likes it hopefully she enjoys it. it's been a while i bought it i just saw it i'm like oh let me treat fury to this i got it for three dollars just some wafers and she can also take it to school like put in a lunchbox for snacking this was on sale we actually do not need pringles i think we got pringles last weekend on sale but it was on sale for four dollars forty cents so i just picked one for fury we got two of these jet biscuits like i said is the same biscuit that had the cheese and the old dog in it so for me fury likes it so it's just the biscuit they eat funny enough my kids are really not big on biscuits anymore compared to when they were growing up before now tofu me is always eating biscuit like carrying biscuit lilon everywhere everywhere but these days he has really changed but we just got two pieces imagine we've, we are coming from a place where we used to buy a box of this biscuit to just buying two pieces in a month we've come this far we've tried anyway we bought two of this it was on sale again i bought the two for six dollars i feel like crying i actually thought this was granola i actually saw granola then the, because they wrote mm, berries in that one and then i went to pick this one now i'm just doing crunchy oat clusters chunky nuts basically we take simple good stuff is this not meant to be granola <laughs> why are you laughing it's not funny it's not funny, it's not funny. tell her hey mugbe it was four dollars fifty cents. Hopefully, it's something I can eat. I'm going to try it, but maybe it's like granola. Maybe it's like it. What's granola? There's something I use for my parfait in the fridge. Oh, anyway, it's what it is. I got that one for four dollars fifty cents. Actually, thought it was granola. There were other things there that they actually wrote granola on, and because those ones they wrote be um, fully berry, and I wanted chunky nuts, so I just like, oh, why is this one in a box? I didn't even think. I didn't process it. I just picked it. But anyway, that's four dollars fifty cents. It's one ham no one. Frosties for free. So I'm afraid likes frosties. I don't know why this frosty is ex expensive compared to the normal um cornflakes, um, Kellogg's cornflakes. The Kellogg's complex, the biggest size can be like seven nine dollars. Whereas this tiny thing, can you guys see how tiny it is? It's seven dollars. But Fury likes it, and I'm that best mommy ever. I'll buy it for her. Today she's looking at me. She's looking at me. Anyway, I got two Doritos for seven dollars. Token it takes this to school on a daily basis. And then I also got two big packs for him that he heats at home. So he has actually advanced from heating this to eating lots of this so that's the the growth so i think the the bag one i got the two for six dollars as well bought a bag of popcorn from woolies and i think we got this for two dollars 75 cents how many comes in a bag ten ten so ten pieces in a bag three opened it already and she started eating it 
so 12 pieces in each pack 12 pieces got three of that for $13.49 I want to believe so this is the three of this textured um, troll for our bedroom I think I got this for $19.99 from Aldi that's $20 is a nice straw. I really like the color and the texture. Oh jeez, I thought this was $19.99. It is $29.99. Bruh. That's expensive. I thought it was $19.99. So this is $30 for this straw. Oh my god, Fred, please take it to my bed. Take it to my room. Thank you. So that's $30 for the texture true. This is the body oil that we use. I got it from Kohl's for $7. Can you guys believe that there was a point I used to buy this oil for $4? How did we get to $7? And at $7, it is on sale. So we've gradually moved from $7 to $5 to $6. Now we're on $7. At, that's the sale price. Some chewing gum for myself. If you know, you know. I love chewing gum. I actually ordered for my favorite gum on Amazon, but it's not going to come until like mid or end of April. So I've just ordered for, I picked up this one in the store today for $10 as backup. Again, I went into Woolies and they were on sale for MK, MCO Beauty items. I picked up a few items. I'm not really into makeup, but this uh, MCO Beauty, they've been raving about it on social media. So, and it was on sale. So I decided to pick some of them up if you know my nighttime routine i usually use lip, uh, lip gloss on my lips at night because i tend to have very um dry and chapped lips in the morning so i usually use lip gloss at night but i saw this overnight lip mask so i picked up one for myself for nine dollars hopefully i don't need lip gloss anymore and i've been Free, can you use this just to open it up for me? No, I also got the same uh, MCO Beauty. I picked up their Magic Brows. Ma is that what it's called? Yeah, Magic Brows. I think this Magic Brows was $10. And lastly, from them, I picked up this mascara for $17. This is expensive. This is all of them is at half price. They were doing 50% 50, 50 off everything MCO Beauty. So I feel like it's expensive. I just when I got to me, I realized that I paid $17 for that. That's the texture of this um, overnight lip mask. And this Emco Beauty is an Australian um, beauty brand. But they said they are, they are very popular for imitating all this. Hmm. Fury, it smells nice. Come and smell it. It smells so good. You want to smell? The camera can't smell it. I know that I'm showing no I'm showing them the inside joke. Did I do today? I don't know the camera can see. Hmm, I love her. Oh gosh, I'm obsessed. Ah Fairy, come and put it on your lips. It tastes it's it tastes like fairy flux. Yeah. Pineapple, one pineapple for $3.99. Not bad. I actually have turkey, but you know, once in a while, when you find it, just buy it because you can go there tomorrow and you will not find. I picked up this turkey for $16.43. It's turkey wings. What? I don't know. Yeah, turkey wings. The one we eat in Nigeria, the actual Nigerian turkey. So it's about, how many pieces is in it? One, two, three, about maybe five or six pieces is usually in the pack. Then garlic bread. We usually buy our garlic bread from Audi. Today's the first time I'm actually seeing that they sell the slice. Usually we'll buy the old one and we'll slice it ourselves. But this is nine slices for $2.79. They're actually on sale. Tofumi followed me again. He saw spring rolls. He has been asking for it to be honest. So luckily today was there. So he had to pick it up by himself. So we picked up this spring rolls for $6.90. No, $6.50 from Kohl's. So it is the cocktail spring roll. So, but what is the shopping without going into Kmart? I made a quick stop at Kmart and I picked up a few things that I needed. I picked up this magnetic whiteboard. This board was six dollars. So, I actually need it for content creation planning stuff. And then I picked up this gel nail polish. I'm all about my nails these days. I don't have the most beautiful nails. See, I just took off my. Um, press on that lasted me for over a month, but see my nails. It's just not it's not so pretty So is it that I paint it or I have press on on and my last press on lasted me a month I'm not about that life again. I just want my nails to have a break. So I'll just use this on it So I picked up that one um, the gel polish was two dollars. No, it is not gel polish. It's just normal They say it gives a gel effect. I got it for two dollars 25 cents i picked up this flat shoe for myself i've been wanting this shoe and anytime i go to kmart i'm always checking for it 
Fury, come and take this one on. This is going to the garage as well. Anytime I go to Kmart, I've been checking for it. I usually not find my size, but luckily today I found my size and this is $15. I bought it from Kmart and then I got this shoe as well from Kmart. I feel like some meetings that I wear flat so I can do better as you know, I go up the ladder at work as well. Representation is important. So I picked up this one for myself and this was $22. I was telling my kids that, see, I don't even have, Tofu Men was buying a shoe the other day for $100. I'm like, I don't even have a shoe that's $50 because I buy most of my shoes from Kmart and maybe Audi if they have and sometimes spend less or famous. I don't have any shoe that is that expensive, but my kids, they have shoes $100 and above. So you see, again, this is just $22, a work shoe picked up this air fryer tray even though it does not like it's not the best fit for my air fryer i have the ninja you know the squ is it square oh, no rectangle ninja but i just picked up this one it will do the one i currently have in it is similar to this and i feel like it's worn out already so i just picked up one of this i picked up this jota because i need it i got it for two dollars Fury, do you want it? Yes. Fury has been telling me she needs a book all day. I've been feeling like she's guilt tripping me, but she has not seen it. So I'm just going to give it. So I got it two dollars. I can actually oh, get what? another one. What? Oh, one. You want one? You didn't ask me. Thank you. You're welcome. And then finally, I got this bag for myself, and I got it for twenty dollars. It is really nice. Let me show you guys. I can carry it like this, or also carry it like this. And it comes with a mini pot. I like it because, again, it has a mini hole here. If I'm going to the office, I can put my bus pass, you know. Pretty, pretty, pretty. Also, for my entryway, I picked up these two Pampas grass from um, Kmart. I know that Pampas grass is out of stock. People are no more using it. But in this Australia, I've been struggling to find nice flowers. So, the ones I saw, they were too expensive. Because it was like too much. And I have Pampas grass actually at my um, entryway. But I feel like that pot was too scanty. So, I just got two more. I got them initially from Kmart. So, I just picked up two more for $12 from Kmart. But every, anyways, that's everything I got today. How do you guys think I did? Like, did they cheat me? Can I get it cheaper somewhere else? Or... What do you think? Do you shop at Coles, Woolies, or do you prefer to go to Costco? But anyways, that's what $540 cost me today. And if you're in Nigeria, don't even bother exchanging it because this is about over $500,000 in today's exchange rate. So, it's what it is. We move. As it's expensive in Nigeria, that's how expensive it is in Australia as well. But I don't think it's too bad. It's too bad. I don't think so. It will last us a while. But anyway, that's about it. Thank you guys so much for watching. Continue the conversation in the comment section. Don't forget to give this video a thumbs up. And I will see you in my next video. Bye.